effective interview preparation requires you to combine an understanding of yourself and your skills and abilities with research about the job and the organisation you are applying to. It is also about getting yourself organised and planning what to take to the interview. Let's start by discussing tips for getting yourself organised. Firstly, make sure you have all the correct and relevant details from the person who contacted you about the interview. This should include the time, location and contact name. You may also ask them for some basic information such as how many people will be interviewing you and whether there are any other specific instructions. You should then prepare your documents to take with you to the interview. You may also require a portfolio to show work or project examples. Your documents should include a copy of your resume, academic transcripts and written references. You may also take a page of notes with you to assist with answering the interview questions. For more information on interview questions, please refer to the video entitled Answering Interview Questions. Next you need to consider practical things such as what are you going to wear. You need to dress in appropriate attire for the position. It is generally safer to be fairly conservative in your style. Men should usually wear a collared shirt, long pants and enclosed shoes, whilst women should avoid wearing anything that is too revealing. Make sure your clothing is clean and neat. Once you have organised yourself, you must then consider how to plan for the actual interview. The key to a successful interview is research. Start by really getting to know your skills, experience and knowledge. Read through your resume, past job descriptions and academic transcripts. Write down key words and short notes to help you remember during the interview. You must also make sure you are familiar with the job advertisement and research as much as you can about the employer. You can find information on the company website by asking people who work in the same industry or by actually visiting the company to get a feel of the working environment and to gain up-to-date information on projects, awards or programs. Once again, write down key words and notes to help you remember. You now need to compare your research on the company and position with your personal skills and experience. Ask yourself this question. If you were the employer, what qualities would you be looking for? Employers like to hear about specific examples that demonstrate your employability skills. For more information about employability skills, please refer to the link on the Career Services homepage. The final part of your research requires you to reflect on why you want this job with this particular company. What are your long and short term career goals? What interests you the most about this company? Remember, needing money is not a good enough reason for an employer to want to hire you. Finally, you need to plan how you are going to get to the interview. Do you need a map or have you got the latest bus or train timetable? Will the time of day affect how long it will take you to get there? If you are driving, will there be parking or will you have to pay for parking? Make sure you have the contact phone number for the employer in case of an accident or emergency that may cause you to be late for the interview. Always try to be about 10 minutes early as it shows you are well organised and allows you to relax and gather your thoughts before the interview begins. That brings us to the end of interview preparation.